Hey guys, welcome back. Another episode of the Laughter and Adventure with Riga United. Now we're a few games into the season now, so we get to have a look at the schedule, have a look see how the game's gone, where we're on the league table, and then quick glance see who's been performing well so far. So on the schedule screen first, and as you will see, we are unbeaten in the league so far. We start with three draws, a 3-3, a 2-2 and a 1-1. Um, and then we managed to get a 4-0 victory to Ogre away from home before putting six past Pirelli at home in a 6-2 victory. So, after the disappointing cup defeat, it's really good and really impressive to see that we've managed to go unbeaten in the league so far. So, onto the league table. And we are sitting in fourth. We're only two points off top, but obviously only five games gone. So, we still have a chance to get up there get the first place, secure it and push on hopefully for promotion. So have a look at the squad screen, they see who's been doing well. Um well, goals first. So out of five games you have Galabov with three, you have Del Campos on three and Kareem is on three. So fair play to them three. Assists wise we have three players on two assists. We have Montalto, Andres and Del Campo. Now onto the key passes. So Del Campo in the attack midfield has 15 key passes. Then Montalto, Karim causes with eight, eight, and then four. Under the interceptions, and obviously there you see the two centre backs with 62 and 50. Then we have Odd with 43. Then our young on loan defender with 31. Average rating. So the best player so far this season is Del Campo. Then it's Karim. Then it's Montalto. Then Cruz. So, fair play, them lads are doing well. And the most valuable player in the squad is Montalto at £23,500. Quick check on the finance of the club. As you see, we have a balance of 44000 now. So, really happy with that. See how the reserves have started under Mr Williams. So, they are in 12th place. They haven't had the greatest start, but hopefully they can push on. Uh, I'm going to actually move a few players down. In fact, I'm going to do that now. Before I forget, so I'm going to give some players back to the reserve team and help them push on. So, Casper, Roman, um, let's say goodbye to our assistant manager Justin, he's going to go and play the reserves for a bit. And um, these players need fitness, they need some game time. So, I'm not doing it just to kind of dump people in the reserves, they're going to get valuable game time in the reserve team, it's going to give them a chance to get. Some f some fitness in their legs and get them performing a bit better for when they do come back up into the first team. Um, I actually want to switch him and drop him into the reserves for now. So I'll put them into the reserves to get a bit of game time. Hopefully the reserves can push on. We'll check more in detail of the reserves and the under-18s who are currently second bomb in 15th. We're going to look a lot more into that next episode now i've moved a few players down because i've noticed that was one of the issues and no doubt as you will see obviously the reserve team manager graham williams he will no doubt be disappointed with me for taking so many players off his hands Um you can see graham's stats there if graham's watching he can obviously see how good they say is determination of 12 discipline of 10 motivation of 8 all these are of 20 so fairly decent fairly average which is good for this level but let's get on to today's game Hopefully we can get a victory against SFK and put ourselves to 1-3, Drew 3. Okay, so Kareem's going off the captain's armband. Um, both our goalkeepers, Murat and Mo, are both out injured. So, disappointed with that. Both of them decided to get injured at the same time. Maybe they were out partying together. Here we go. We're on a good run lately, so come on, let's push on. I have faith. I have faith. Telling every single one, the defence, the midfield and the strikers, that I have the faith. Here we go. The game's underway. Labonte <laughs> looks like he just bounces off the back of Del Campo, but he does well to get back and collect it. Let's go and drop this down so we can see the, the teams at the bottom of the table there. Causes and Galabov, Del Campo. Galabov, how wide to Odd? Great play this. Ah, blocks, but Odd's going to pick it back up. Inders Roman, ah, he just got intercepted. Causes picked it up though. Back to Brew. Galabov. Montalto, Del Campo, Kareem. Kareem hits post, but he was offside. Really good build up play though. Fantastic to watch and definitely better than um, the 
cup game, which I'm sure you guys will agree, the last game you watched. So we're currently on 10 points with 6 games. If all the scores stayed how they are, but we managed to get a win, we would actually go join top. So let's hope. Let's hope for a boring round of fixtures for all the other teams and we can get a victory. So we've had 66% possession in the first 35 minutes. Um, Kareem's picked up a knock. Latifi's going to come in. Obviously, it's good that we've got a player of such quality on the bench to rotate with Kareem. So there we are, 36 minutes gone. Well in. Latifi to Del Campo. Del Campo tries to pass it but gets blocked. Come on, Del Campo. In the Montalto. Lafton nearly picks it up, but unfortunately it's intercepted. Labonte there to Lafty. It's Warman to Galabov. Del Campo causes a wide to Carl Brew. Brew in. It's Warman. Back post. Fantastic. What a play that was. That is football which should be grace in the European stage. What some passing in. That was fantastic. Brew picks up. He just takes a touch. Now left footed into the box. Del Campo misses it. I think the defender obviously held him down so he couldn't jump for the header bit. Just falls for Zwarman at the back post. And if the scores stay as they are, we are actually going top of the league. It's passionate. Things are going well, but I know you can do even better. So come on. Ovenko, Skriba, Sempertovs. Be fantastic if the scores did stay the same. Be nice to go top of the league. Montalto, Antelito, Del Campo, Galabov. Ah, it's just blocked. Odd picked it up though. Down to Zwarman. Great ball in. Ah, oh, lucky. Oh, lefty, lefty. Two times. No, just couldn't get it in the back of the net. Galabov, Montalto. Ah, it's just intercepted. Unlucky, come on. Some great football being played here. Carl Bruder, Del Campo. Galabov. To Zwarman. Del Campo. Del Campo, oh! Del Campo nearly scores an absolute worldie. Oh, that was very, very close. Make some substitutions. Well, just the one, I think. I'm going to bring on Kreuz, because um, he's a good player, and Causes can have a rest. I'm just looking at all the other, the other results at the minute. It's um, the game there at the top 16. Oh, we've got the goal. Is there an own goal, or was it Lafty? It was Lafty. Sorry, Latifi. I always get his name pronounced wrong. Do apologise. Cabo then, Del Campo. Del Campo left footed in. What a ball in. And actually, it's beautiful. You can see him just cushioned that header across. Yeah, I was just in there, this gust. Oh! As I'm talking around, two comes have took the lead. So they've actually gone two points clear. And we have just conceded as I'm talking about that as well. That's disappointing to just concede there as I'm in conversation. Great corner. Sometimes you've got to hold your hands up, but that should have been cleared. Should have been cleared. It should never have fell for him just to calmly slot that away. But Carl Brew in the Montalto. Gabov. Oh, hit the post, then hit the keeper. Oh, 16.25 actually took... 16 leapage have actually scored an equaliser. So it's now 1-1 one, one with two comes, and we are back to top of the table. We are top of the table. That sounds nice. That sounds nice to say. We are top of the table. We are top of the table. We are clearance, Montalto. Zwarman. Zwarman's picked it up. Galabov. Del Campo. Del Campo back to Kreuz. Kreuz and Galabov. Unlucky. Come on, just hold out. We've literally just got to hold on this lead for two more minutes. Lafty, Del Campo's in, make it three, Del Campo makes it three, that is three, one, Riga United, get in there, come on Riga, fantastic to get that there, delighted, 
Fantastic. Look at that. Keeper's not saying that. Too much power. Too much power. That's going to be the whistle. We have won it. And Riga United have gone top of the table after six games. Very happy with the result. Let's check the schedule and see when you're going to come back and join us again, lads. Um, then I'm going to go to here against um, Olena at home. So, again, it's a few games played. It gets us through the league, so you can see how it's going a lot further in. We've got a few home games in there as well. Three home games, three away. So, hopefully we can be top of the table still, especially when we're playing two comes just before you come back to join us as well. So, But thanks for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed it. If you have, please leave a like below, and I will see you next time.